Hi y'all, welcome back to another cleaning video. Today we are doing a nighttime clean with me. We're going to clean up this messy house and I'm also going to give y'all a dinner idea and show y'all how to make this amazing pasta bake. So if you need some cleaning motivation or you want somebody to clean alongside you, keep you company, this is the video for you, so just keep on watching. So in one of my last videos, I showed y'all how I meal prep and I seasoned some different bags of chicken and now I'm taking the more Italian style one out of the freezer and I also had this cheese and this heavy cream that I needed to use up. So in case you're wondering, when I season that chicken and I put it in the freezer, I don't always have a like idea that I have in mind I just know that it's in there and I wait for the idea to come usually when I have other ingredients that I need to use like the cheese or the heavy cream so I shredded up that cheese I'm cooking that chicken and I'll write what it has already seasoned down below in the description bar but it's just like an Italian style like olive oil balsamic Italian seasoning salt pepper onion type of situation and then I'm just cooking that down and then I'm adding some of that heavy cream. And I also put some of that chicken bouillon powder that I was showing you and some garlic. And I'm just going to cook this until it is like bubbling again. And I'm gonna add in a good amount of that cheese and the penne pasta that I cooked it two minutes short of its cooking time on the box so that I can mix this all together and bake it. This one was a humongous hit. So this is it all kind of mixed together. I'm just trying to get it evenly coated here and try to get everything coated in that liquid. And then I, of course, had to add more cheese. You gotta to top it off with another good little handful or two of that mozzarella cheese. And then I'm gonna throw it in the oven on 350. Since I was making this like right then, it only needed about 30 minutes this type of thing i used to like meal prep basically the night before or during nap time and then it would need a little bit longer in the oven because it would have been in the fridge but yeah after 30 minutes in the oven at 350 it was golden brown and bubbling and absolutely delicious everybody asked for seconds it was so good so that was a hit with my family and the best thing about these kind of baked dinners is that i had 30 minutes to start cleaning up so i'm gonna start in the living room since basically my kids are just gonna eat take a bath and go to bed so i want to get a head start on this cleaning so i can have as much time to relax as possible so i'm just using the anti-back method multi-purpose cleaner and i'm just going to clean all the touch surfaces and just a really random but quick review quick but random i really don't care for this cleaner i might have to try their regular multi-purpose cleaner if y'all have had better luck with their regular one but the antibacterial one i bought when i was trying to disinfect everything after we had all been sick i really do not like it for cleaning purposes i always feel like it does not clean as well. It does not get off like sticky stuff as well. A lot of the time I have to go over things twice with it. I definitely like my Miss Myers multi-surface cleaner way more. The Mr. Clean multi-purpose that you can just dilute in water in a spray bottle. I like that way more. Yeah, if y'all have had better luck with the regular multi-surface cleaner from this brand method, let me know. But I really like their their bathroom cleaners so I was surprised that I didn't like this one but yeah it just doesn't work very well in my opinion I hate having to go over everything twice when other cleaners I don't have to do that so there's my little two cents on that I'm gonna use it up so you're gonna see me using it throughout this video but yeah it's I'm not gonna repurchase it once it's done so I was just wiping everything down in the living room. I'm putting away the kids' toys into their little baskets and their blankets. And then I just spray everything down really quick with some Miss Myers room spray just to freshen everything up. And I spray the fabrics of the room, like the couch and the curtains, because it makes the scent last way longer. And I absolutely love that. And for my nighttime cleans, I typically don't do the floor because we're all just trying to wind down and relax. So yeah, you're not gonna see me vacuum or mop or anything in this video and that is why i usually do that 
during my daytime cleans and naptime cleans. And then I just quickly straightened up the dining room as well. Once we were all done eating, I just needed to wipe off the table and put that back to normal. And now we are moving on to the kitchen. And you would think, oh my gosh, like I, you loaded the dishwasher and there's barely any dishes left. Wrong. Look at this huge pile of dishes that I left on the stove. Yeah, I had to move them out of the way to like a more easily load the dishwasher. That is what happens when you cook and bake all day and you don't clean up from dinner the night before. And yeah, it just piles up. And then you have a lot of stuff that you need to hand wash like I'm doing right now. So I absolutely loaded down that dishwasher and now I'm going to hand wash every single thing that is left over because I wanted this to be a full, full reset. I did a little bit of meal prepping and baking and things. I needed to use up some bananas before they got even more, you know, ripe. So I had a lot of cooking under my belt this day. So I had a lot of dishes. So I'm just going to hand wash all these babies and give this kitchen a, the full reset that it deserves. This is your first time watching one of my videos. First of all, thank you. And secondly, I would just like to introduce myself to anyone who is new. My name is Lauren. I am a married mother of two. I live here in Wyoming with my cute little family and our two dogs and we are absolutely loving it we are not originally from here we moved here for my husband's job almost two years ago and we are just absolutely loving it aside from cleaning and doing makeup like i do on my other youtube channel and on tiktok and instagram and all over the place i love the outdoors my whole like my husband my kids we all love to be outside as much as possible and we are absolutely loving it in Wyoming because that is one of the main things to do. It's absolutely beautiful here. Um, this summer, I am hoping to travel a little bit more, so expect to see some really fun vlogs. That is the other thing I like to post on this channel. Anything like mom-related, cooking, cleaning, family vlogs, fun stuff to do with your kids, sensory bins, stuff like that. I try to just set up my phone and film it for you guys so that you guys can get some fun ideas or get some good vlogs of things to do outside with your kids. And yeah, I just hope you stick around. Again, thanks for watching. And to anybody who is watching, thank you for ever watching one of my videos, for liking, commenting, subscribing, anything. I really, really appreciate it. Once every last dish is hand wash, spoiler alert, that wasn't every last dish, but we'll get to that later. I'm going to spray down the sink with some Dawn Power Wash and give that a very, very good scrub out. And I don't know if you saw earlier, another great way to use the Dawn Power Wash. I mean, it's not really another great way. It's like the way that they market it. When I do have that big pile of dishes going on, I love to spray them with the Dawn Power Wash. Then they can just sit while I wash everything else and it makes it so much easier to hand wash them, obviously, because they've just been sitting there soaking and it's so good. So I guess marketing approved, it works the way that they say it does when you use it the way that you're supposed to. 
I absolutely love that. And I also will spray down my stove top. You'll see me scrub that in a minute. I love to let that just sit while I wash all the dishes because then when you go back, all that product has done most of the work for you and it's so much easier on you. You don't have to scrub as hard. So after I'm done scrubbing out the sink, I actually ran some soap and ice through the garbage disposal. This is a really good quick way to clean it out and to make sure there's nothing jammed in there and stuck. And I just ran that with some cold water until it was all flushed through. And then I went ahead and sprayed the anti back all in the sink and around the outside just because I already had it handy and it's great for cleaning and it is really great for antibacterial purposes too. So I'm just gonna let that sit in there and basically be disinfected. And I just wipe down the outside of the sink and the windowsill. And then I'm basically doing the exact same thing to my stovetop, scrub that down with the Dawn Power Wash. And then I wipe everything off and then give it a really good once over, even on the back and the handles with that method antibacterial cleaner. And that is the stovetop perfectly clean, ready to go and make breakfast first thing in the morning. And then as you can see, that wasn't every last dish because I forgot these two random plates were on the island holding the muffins and banana bread that I made. So there's two plates left in the sink, but did you see that pile of dishes that I washed? I think I earned not washing those other dishes. Those can go in the dishwasher tomorrow. And for now, I'm just going to wipe off the rest of the sink. And you might notice I got some really cute little jars back there where I'm putting my cake stand with those muffins and banana bread on it. I got those as a steal from a consignment shop or like a thrift store. Oh my gosh, they're so cute, but I haven't fully styled them yet. So I want to get something cute for them to like sit on. So I will show you guys that in a video when I do it. And now I'm just finishing wiping off the island and again you're gonna see me go over this island a second time it's just because that method cleaner just isn't my favorite but we got it done that is the nighttime power hour clean with me complete if you are still cleaning along with me i have an entire playlist right here on the screen and always linked down below of all my cleaning motivation videos so you can keep cleaning right along with me and it also has my other youtube channel my tiktok and my instagram down there if you want to follow me everywhere and i will see you guys in another video very soon bye